morning, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Today's episode of my GM series of NXT, we're going up to Fastlane. Simple as that. Nothing really said. Um, we're just going to get right into it. No real news other than uh, there's some rumors going on or, uh, over the next uh, PLE at Backlash that either th these are just high rumors uh, that either Roman's gonna uh, return even though he's still taking time off you know to return but I don't think they're gonna push that and they're also saying that Brock could come back and feud with Gunther just like he was supposed to do before Eh, I don't know that if that's gonna happen because there's still heat going on with uh, the lawsuit and stuff like that and then the next rumor is that Cody could turn heel I don't know about that maybe not so soon I mean they do say the best time to turn somebody heel is when they're on top and another rumor is that they could do that to Randy and have Randy after Cody defense he can come out and celebrate with Cody again and then deliver him a nice RKO those are just the rumors that are going on I just wanted to let you all let y'all know inform you but we're just gonna get right into this episode four shows to fast lane this is the card that I have booked up I want to try to see if rivalries matter more than titles so I have a bunch of rivalries going this I just want to start or not start but this is going to be like in my mind an eliminator for the NXT title uh, I have LA calling out cash I have the, uh, these tag teams calling out I'm pairing up Cindy with uh, Vicky and just for now because I'm going to put her back against the title whoever gets it but as of right now I'm just gonna have her paired up with a, a tag team so I can also use Vicky uh, that's what I'm doing I have th these tag teams uh, fighting each other, so after this rivalry is over, whoever has the tag titles, ta tag titles, sorry, um, they'll go up against each other. I just have some rivalries popping off. This, I just have this tag team going off because I don't want to uh, reuse the same uh, teams as before because I don't want it to get stale and also, you know, perfect matchup fighter, bruiser, heels, faces. So, you know, we have more options uh, brewing. This is my thought of it. But just like uh, the last episode, um, uh, Mi Chen, she's out for three weeks because we got that uh, promo thing so she can do a movie and stuff like that. So I do have extra cash. And personally, I am going to add it to stadium and then we'll go from there uh, nope nothing here uh, talents I'm thinking uh, maybe at the end of fat the fast lane show maybe we go over here and scout a, a legend or somebody like that just to bring them in I mean I could bring in regal and stuff like that but I think that's a little too early just for now We're just going to hop right into this first show of the week. Uh, I'm expecting it not to go good. That's just, that's just my head in it. I don't think it's going to go very well, but we'll see if rivalries really matter. But first match, Mr. Nosedive and McStones. Oof. McStones wins. It's mediocre. Uh-huh. That's a good rivalry, so we have that going. Not bad, we can start that. Next match, Del Cruz and Kemp. Kemp wins. Uh, we have more rivalry grow there, but I am just going to swing it. Kemp is gonna go for the NXT title, so hopefully we can negate that. We have that tag title rivalry grow, that's good. We can use it next week. This tag team, Let's see what happens here. Carter and Ignition wins. It's mediocre. Beautiful. LA Knight calls out Cash. We can work on that. And then main event, Grimes and Wolfgang. Wolfgang wins. It's a great match. 
the rivalry grows even more. It's gonna be, I, I, had a, I had a feeling it was going to be a bad card. I, I just, I had a feeling of it, so, yeah, that, that, that's, that's just me. But our show quality was B, which is good, but still, we only got 12,000 fans, so. 5,000 from WCW, 52 by uh, Raw, which is fucking crazy, like hell. Bunch of new fans, I don't, I don't know, but 18 by SmackDown, so everyone had a bad week. Select a contract. This could be a huge card. Because... I could go out and get somebody huge with that. So maybe I still do that. That is huge. Alright, next week's show. Uh, it's a little jumbled up. We got a couple uh, extra rivalries going through. Nice uh, TLC between... Uh, these two guys because they've been sitting around a little bit and uh you know what do it this way um i know their popularity is down a little bit so i have to get them in matches i know i have to include them a little bit more uh we have a title uh, tag title on the line might as well i have a call out of lee to michen um and then between jackson and kemp i'm going to try to boost this rivalry so that's why i have a dual call out because i if I remember correctly, if you have a level one rivalry, you can it can get dissolved if you do something else to gain another singles rivalry because you can't have two single rivalries. You can only have one single and one tag team, which I think they should change that so you can so you can have like a, a triple threat that goes better or something like that. That's what I think they should add into this game so you can have triple threats because m most triple threats they kind of they kind of suck, but we're going with this, and uh, maybe I, uh, maybe in the future I turn uh, uh, Jackson face, because why not? But uh, here we go, because a lot of our champions are heels, so we need, you know, need a baby face. Or maybe I do it uh, if the rivalry uh, does kick off. Maybe I do that anyway. But this is the second card once again. Not a strong card, but we have we do have some good matches, hopefully some good callouts and a title match. And all of them have rivalries, so we can work with that. Alright, first match, Carter and Silver. Carter wins because Ignition helps. It's an amazing match, beautiful. Love that. Promo is okay. Next match, Heath and Evans. Me it's mediocre, but it grows. It's mostly mediocre because of the fan base, so... I'm probably going to throw them right back into another match for popularity-wise. That promo, okay, that, that doesn't help out, so I'm just going to put them in a match next week. Alright, next match, Mahal and Gallows. They have a rivalry, so this should go over nicely. It's a draw. It's a good draw. Alright, I haven't seen draws in a while. Alright, we have that rivalry grow, which is perfect. And main event time, who's going to win the title? Cindy and Vicky win, so we can. This rivalry is growing nicer. We have um, it was this week was a lot worse than the week prior, which I was kind of expecting a little bit. Four stars, three star, two star, not bad. I know we had a poor finale. Apparently, SmackDown and Raw, yeah, because they both had titles on the line. I mean, we'd had titles on the line too, but man. Uh, nine thousand fans from that. <laughs> WCW lost 4,000 fans. 40,000 by Raw. Raw is just growing. Okay, uh, third card of the week. This is what I have set up. I have a title between these two. Hopefully, that helps out. Uh, we just have an uh, extreme rules match between these two to help grow that rivalry just a little bit. You know, draw it out over time. Uh, next match, we have Gallows and these two. Uh, Heath and Nick Flintstone. <laughs> it, you know, eh, kind of is what it is. I also put a um, fix a match on Anderson and Gallows to win because I also need Heath because uh, Heath has a rivalry between, um, what the heck? why am I forgetting the person's name? Um, who does Heath have a, um, 
lurch so I want that to continue also because it's three stars um, I have a call out between gallows and Mahal just just to help boost that rivalry a little bit so next time I use it it's good uh, Zaya Lee I have a um, Uh, just try to help her popularity grow a little bit and then main event I want Grimes and Wolfgang's rivalry to end because it's been kind of going on a little bit it's not too long but it's been going on a bit and I feel like if if this rivalry ends and Kemp and Smooth can't get a rivalry going uh, I can put Grimes against Smooth those are my thoughts. Uh, we also have uh, Lurch who went up to level 6. Uh, give you tables. Why not? So, and then uh, next week we get our we get our champ back and Jade back. Which I also want to end the rivalry between Jane and Henley. Because that's been going on since the very... Since last season, so I think it's time to finally, finally end it, so, because I can, I can put Henley against somebody else, or tag teams, stuff like that, but this is this third week's card, let's just get right into it, first match, let's see who wins the title, Kemp wins, mediocre, no rivalry, okay, Fumbling that bag a little bit. Next match, uh, LA versus Cash. Cash wins. Rivalry grows, it's okay. Good two and a half stars. Uh, weak promo, but that rivalry grows. Gallows and Anderson win. So that's good. That rivalry between Evans and, and uh, Heath grow to level four, so that's nice. She got plus three to popularity, that's good. And then main event, who's gonna win? Wolfgang wins. Rivalry complete, four stars, that's good, that's what we needed. Uh, poor opening, this, uh, I'm kinda jumbling up these rivalries and stuff like that. I'm kind, I'm, I need to get that situated. We got 14,000 fans though, we got plus almost 200,000, so that's good. Next, WCW, only got 9,000, 17,000 for that. We got To the Moon, that's good. I can use it on some of the lower stars to help with those ratings. So we're boosting up there. That's nice. We got a week till fast lane. Glad it worked out for you the week out. This is what the card's looking like. I have, uh, I know this this one is stale. That's why I have, that's why I have it in a steel cage match. That's why I have it ending this week. But it's just a bunch of single matches. Uh, you already know what I'm doing with, with this one. I don't have to explain that. This I have to for the boost of the rivalry. This one I have uh, to also just give them another match. Uh, work on Heath's morale. And I believe this one is also going to be in the PLE. And it's also going to be a steel cage to end this rivalry. Because Grimes is going to be absolutely um, gassed. So I'm not going to put him in that PLE. That's why I have Jackson calm Grimes out already. So he can have a, like another week off. Jackson can have another week off. And then, or, and then the, during the PLE, I can do like a promo or something to boost his popularity. That's what I'm, that's all what I'm doing. Okay, get right into it. I also have a bunch of money. So I'm thinking of doing another upgrade. But let's just get right into this match. Chan wins. Mediocre, but that rivalry grows, so I can use it next week. Excellent. That rivalry grows beautifully. We already know who's winning here. Grimes wins. It's going to be that's a good match. Nice. Uh, we have this call out, so that rivalry grows a little bit. Nice. We have. Oh no, excuse me. This is going to end the week after the PLE. That, that's what I was doing. 
just trying to work on his morale. Uh, excellent promo, plus 6,000 fans, good. And then we're ending this rivalry, who's going to win it? Shane wins this rivalry. Not a bad drama curve. Very. This is a very mid uh, week. 14,000 fans, not bad. Got plus 200,000, so I can absolutely upgrade something. Plus 7,000 for WCW, 57. <laughs> How is Raw getting 57,000 each week? How are they doing it? All right, PLE is here. Um, I'm going to upgrade the the crew here, the expert crew. So that's good for the superstars. Uh, hopefully that helps with the show and, and its, um, its ratings. I am not activating any uh, card yet and fighting champs I'm probably gonna use for the next PLE, not this one. Uh, this is the PLE lineup. We have uh, some pretty good rivalries going here. We've got some call-outs, hopefully. We've got Charity. Uh, Nick's not happy, but you know, we'll address that later. Uh, we only have one non-title match, mostly because, uh, like I said before, Grimes is uh, dirt-tired. So we can we can worry about that another uh, another time. Uh, let's just get right into the PLE. I'm hoping for a good one. Uh, first match. Women's titles on the line again. Jane and Ivy win it back. That's a good rivalry. Jane's out for two weeks, but we, already have, a, we have a card for that. That rivalry grows. We can continue working on that. Excellent. Good promo for uh, Jackson. The mid card. LA versus Cash. LA finally dethrones Cash, but that rivalry grows, so we can still work on that. Good pop from Nick. We're going to be using him next week anyway. Next title match on the line. Who's going to win? Heath and Flintstone win. That's a good switch, so we can work on that next week. And then the following weeks. That rivalry grows. We can use that next week as well. Alright, then one non-title match, but I made it a backstage brawl, so something can happen. Queen and Precious win. It was a good match. So that rivalry grows for that tag, women's tag, to work on to the next one. Uh, good uh, good charity event by uh, Jinder. And then main event, Lee Chen, who's going to win the women's title. Lee dethrones Lee Chen. That rivalry grows to three, so we're look we're sitting pretty for next uh, next episode. SmackDown better not like I don't understand how how they beat us there. But all right, what storytelling? Oh, rivalry complete on a normal match, so they get as many ratings as a Extreme Rules match for a title. Yeah, it makes sense. Triple Threat by by them. All right, that works for them. We finally got B's show quality and match card. We got plus 118,000 fans. Pretty damn good. Our budget went up. Uh, so we can continue upgrading the venues, which is good. WCW got more fa fans than us. Okay. You know, fuck you, WCW. 151 buys Raw. SmackDown got 86,000. Beautiful. I'm going to be using that. Uh, next episode, uh, I am going to go all out on a, either WCW or SmackDown to catch up to them because fuck it, I'm 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 going for it. I can in next episode. Oof, next episode is going to be interesting. I'll tell you that. Uh, we got trades. Maybe I can work on a trade. Uh, the only person I'm going to get rid of is Wolfgang. Uh, I don't know what to. Eat use for him right now so I am going to trade him away. Alright, this is the end of the episode. If you made it this far, please leave a like, comment, subscribe. I appreciate you clicking on the video and I will see you tomorrow. Peace.